I'm Micah. I'm Jenna. And this is our hometown of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Minneapolis and St. Paul are two large cities and they're connected by the Mississippi River and together they're nicknamed the Twin Cities. We are travel bloggers and so we travel and do photo and video on the road for a living. So when we do come back home, we love to try and be the tourist or try and be the out-of-towner that comes back and rediscovers our home. Minneapolis and St. Paul is really well known for their art culture. And right now we're here at the Wiseman Art Museum, uh, which was designed by Frank Gehry, and it's one of the 55 museums that we have in the Minneapolis-St. Paul area. So anywhere you go in the Twin Cities, you'll have some good things to see. Now we're in the North Loop neighborhood in Minneapolis. It's not far from downtown, and it's one of the faster growing neighborhoods in the cities, and it's one of the trendier districts. And what's really cool is this place is filled with a lot of warehouse buildings that have been recently converted into boutique shops, restaurants, cafes, and I mean, it's just generally a great place to come hang out and spend your day. I'm gonna go in here. All right, have fun. America is the biggest mall in the United States and it's one of the largest attractions in the Twin Cities. We've both been coming here since we were little children and in college we both actually worked at the mall. You can see all around us there's tons of stores with a big amusement park right in the middle of all of them. So aside from shopping, people don't realize how big of a place this really is. So you can also come here for adventure. You can come and go on roller coasters, you can go mini golf, go-karting, uh, go down to a big sea life underwater aquarium where you can walk underneath sharks. There's a movie theater, there's arcades, there's a zip line. Tons uh, of restaurants. Lots and, of restaurants. And yeah, there's shopping too. We're about to have the Juicy Lucy. It's an iconic burger that was invented in the area, and there's a little bit of controversy over who invented it, but we know who the real creators were. The cool thing about this is that the cheese is actually cooked inside of the burger. So when you take that first bite, you gotta be careful of all the cheese oozing out of it. Uh, they say to fear the cheese, and there's a good reason to do that, but it's a delicious must-have when coming to Minneapolis. Another great thing about the Minneapolis and St. Paul area is all the nature that we have here. So although this is a big city, you can always escape that and get into a lot of nature too. So if you're an active person, this is a great place to be, whether you like to bike, run, hike, jog, kayak, any of that, there's so much to do right within the city limits. St. Paul is the other half of the Twin Cities, and it's basically like Minneapolis's twin sibling, and it's also where we call home. Although they're called the Twin Cities, they're quite different. St. Paul is really known for their neighborhoods. I mean, you have Summit Avenue that has the largest stretch of Victorian homes in the U.S., Grand Ave, Cathedral Hill, which gives it kind of more of that neighborhood vibe. Good, how are you? Awesome. What can I do you for? We're, uh, we're just checking out a flight, see what they have for their local flavors of beer. There's a lot of brewery options in the Twin Cities. And I think a lot of it goes back to kind of like the history of beer here. A lot of people think it's a very Scandinavian culture, which it is, but there's a lot of German culture here too. And I think that's where a lot of like the brew history comes from.
Minneapolis and St. Paul is huge in sports. We have all the major sports teams. We have hockey, football, baseball, basketball. And now we're at the St. Paul Saints game. It's not the Major League Baseball, but it's minor league, and they're a lot of fun. Then go go check it out. <laughs> We had a great time showing you around Minneapolis and St. Paul. We hope to see you soon. Cheers. Cheers.